Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. I post every day bringing you the latest updated tarot reading and predictions. I also live stream every day on my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot, giving live personal readings. Link to my main channel is in the description box below. In this reading, we're going to get you some important messages that you need to hear right now. And today is the 30th of October 2023. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 9.39 a.m. Okay, Virgo, let's get your reading started. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo. Important messages that Virgos need to hear right now. Virgo, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and whoever could be in your energy field right now. This reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. The Empress at the bottom of the deck. Now, Virgo, the funniest thing is that before I did your reading, I kept have, having this song called The Lemon Tree playing in my head. Um, I think it's a song from the 90s by The Fool's Garden. I think it's a German band. So check out those <laughs> the lyrics of that song, okay? I kept seeing yellow. I kept hearing that song, um, Lemon Tree, Lemon Tree. But actually, you know what? Let me search for the lyrics, Lemon Tree. Lemon Tree lyrics. And you know, the Empress is somebody very, very abundant, right? And a lemon tree, a tree is abundant and there's lemon <laughs> on that tree. I don't know why I keep seeing that yellow. Look, even it's yellow right here. Yellow everywhere, okay, Virgo? So something, I think it has a message. So in this song it says i'm sitting here in a boring room it's just another rainy sunday afternoon i'm wasting my time i've got nothing to do so now this song is it's a lonely song okay and look at the hangman here wearing yellow as well there's so much yellow and I think this could be somebody who is waiting for you, okay? Look at the King of Wands right here. Especially if this person is a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Can be any sign, can also be a Virgo, a Gemini. Um, Sagittarius again, Scorp can Scorpio, can be any sign, okay? Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. So this song is about loneliness. So this person could be feeling lonely. Without you, I feel so lonely. I'm waiting for you, but nothing ever happens. I feel like this is somebody where um, they could have been waiting for you or you could have been waiting for this, this person. Bear in mind, it could go vice versa. And then it says right here, all that yesterday you told me about the blue, blue sky and all that I can see is just a yellow lemon tree. I'm turning my head up and down i'm turning 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 around and all that i can see is just another lemon tree okay now this part is the the part what i feel could be the message i'm sitting here i miss the power i like to go out um take in a shower but there's a heavy cloud inside my head i feel so tired put myself into bed well nothing ever happens i wonder so Basically, this song is about this guy waiting for his girlfriend to show up on a Sunday, Sunday afternoon, and she didn't show up, okay? <laughs> um, I think that could be it. Isolation is not good for me. Isolation, I don't want to sit on the lemon tree. Also, this guy has been waiting, sitting on the lemon tree, waiting for this for for his girlfriend to turn up but didn't turn up so i feel like 
yeah, I'm driving around in my car. I'm driving too fast. I'm driving too far. I like to change my point of view. I feel so lonely. I'm waiting for you, but nothing ever happens. And I wonder, yeah, this part is the message. I feel Virgo, somebody could be feeling very lonely without you or just have been waiting for you. They may or may not tell you this, okay? But um, it could be waiting for a text, waiting for a phone call, or just waiting because both of you could be in a long distance connection okay and life is just too boring without you yeah because the yellow lemon tree song it's about like i'm just so bored i'm sitting under the tree i'm just waiting and waiting and you know either it's because you're not there or you didn't show up or you didn't text them didn't reply to them bear in mind virgo that this message could go vice versa but no the empress is somebody to me, Empress is you, okay? Empress, even though um, it's Libra, but it could be Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. It's, this is a Mother Earth soul to me. It's an earthy sign. No matter what, I always read the Empress as a Virgo. I definitely see that um, this person sees your abundance, your worth, your value, right? Very interested in you. Bear in mind, Virgo, if this is... If you don't have anybody right now, this could be somebody who is coming in. This could be a prediction, okay? Now, the hangman feels like the yellow lemon, like just lemon tree, right? Hanging, waiting, um, and look at the head. looks like a lemon as well. <laughs> and we've got the magician in reverse and six of pentacles in reverse. So this person could be wondering if this is one-sided. Uh, feeling lonely or feeling lonely because you're not there with them because you bring a lot of abundance to their life and they feel like they can't quite manifest you or manifest things to turn out the way they want to turn out but it could also mean that they're not actually actively partaking in and making something happen between two of you although the desire is there, okay? Or that they just can't, it's out of the control, okay? So we've got the lovers right here. So this person's got you on your brain, love on your brain, or you may have love on your brain, or them in your brain. I'm sensing it's more like them for majority of you, like at least 90% of you is this person just watching you, waiting for you, um, interested, definitely desiring you, and the judgment here is in row first. So although this person is interested, they may not want to make a bad judgment call. I don't see them really wanting to rush into um, jumping into conclusion or rush into contacting you or rush into, you know, wanting things to move too quickly. I see them taking their, their time, even though the king of wands is the, is the king of action, but um, he's also sitting down and the surrounding cards are suggesting that He's just basically, doesn't matter he or she, not gender specific, just basically watching intently, waiting for time to take actions, to strike, okay? <laughs> um, the tower here is in reverse because I feel like this person is being extra careful. I don't see this person wanting to, you know, be too forward or too desperate, seem too desperate, even though deep down there's so much fire in them just burning, okay? burning up and Virgo again it could be you or this person and the temperance is in one first see this person feels very unsettled this is like a very unsettling feeling where um it's like I'm not comfortable I, I don't feel balanced because I can't stop thinking about Virgo and I also I think they're being extra careful because of the four cups here in reverse so they don't want to say the wrong thing don't want to do the wrong thing because they don't want you to be a missed opportunity let's pull out more cards here Virgo let's see more look I just keep seeing yellow everywhere look at the queen of wands in reverse where, what color is she wearing? Yellow. <clears throat> and then we've got these seven of swords right here. Okay, Virgo, this person um, could be just being very, trying to be very smart about the whole thing. I really don't see them wanting to make the wrong move. I see them not wanting to scare you away, scare you off. 
they're being extra extra careful and the queen of wands here in reverse it just makes me feel like the, the, because the six of pentacles here is in reverse as well they see you being very calm cool and collected right so they don't really um how do you say they don't really know if you're really that interested because the queen of wands is in words but perhaps you're not really showing desperation or that you want them so badly so they could be um just wandering off with their mind right here with the seven of swords because swords can indicate thoughts right so they could be thinking like what should i do is virgo interested in me and you are right here with the um <clears throat> magician in reverse which is you so maybe you're not taking any actions towards them and you don't show like you're too desperate or you are you know um maybe you are not taking full action towards this person perhaps non-action for some of you so it makes them feel much more interested makes them wonder more about you makes them miss you even more. Virgo, let me take a sip of my coffee right here. Okay, Virgo. Now we've got Emperor here in reverse. Five of Swords in reverse. Ten of Wands. So this person is carrying all of these thoughts, feelings for you by themselves. I see them operating on this on on their own in their mind just um because again six of pentacles in one verse right they feel very alone in this whole thing this all one person one person's show <laughs> virgo so i definitely see that this person could be just carrying again all these thoughts feelings or planning strategizing all on their own all in their head and feeling really imbalanced and again temperance in reverse as well so you're in a good place right with the empress right here unless rose are reversed here but you're in a good place you are like sitting here comfortable being yourself knowing that knowing your own worth your own value and knowing what you can give what you can bring to the table and you are somewhat unfazed by it um whether it's true or not okay virgo because but they may see you as that right you could be playing your cool because i do see the empress as just like i'm just i'm just chill because i know this is what i can bring to the table i know my worth and my value so i'm not going to even try to prove anything because you should know and then we've got the emperor right here in our verse right but this is a match an emperor and an empress so it's a, supposed to be a true match but the emperor is in reverse that means this person um, may either feel like they're not as ready as you or not as confident as you are not as abundant as you are there is a sense of insecurities right there but for in a very twisted way it feels like maybe this person even though they know that both of you are a true match but there's still something lacking within themselves that i think they could be actually comparing themselves to you they still feel like something is lopsided okay I feel like it has something to do with um, perhaps them trying to keep up with you as well. Because the Ten of Wands, you know, just trying to get to this place here, this destination, but alone carrying all of these wands. So they could be thinking like, I need to step up so I can keep up with Virgo. Five of Swords and Malverse, also I feel like at some point in time they could be feeling a little bit defeated by the whole thing or, or trying to keep up with you or give you what they think you deserve and i do think that they think you deserve everything okay deserve to be treating treated like the empress deserve to have this equal give and take connection and i see them just can't help it but be very attracted to you with the lovers here i feel like at the back of their mind they know that you are the person for them okay they know that both of you are supposed to be together are supposed to be a, a good match but i feel like virgo it it's not you it's it feels like it's them they're overthinking they are carrying all kinds of responsibilities or all kinds of um, baggages that 
they don't need to be carrying, okay? That they don't need to be carrying. And we've got the ten of swords right here, which can be an indication of a separation. Maybe both of you are separated. I just saw 14, 14. Check, check out your angel, angel number if you want to. Ten of swords. Um, and you've got two, two tens here as well. I think, Virgo, this person is thinking something needs to end, as in their old ways of thinking. Their old... You know, because the emperor can be quite stubborn, set in his own ways, he or she not gender specific again. So something along the lines of feeling as though something all needs to go, uh, always of thinking, always of doing things, and it's time to step up. Because I see the king of wands here, it's like I'm interested in making these changes. I'm interested to ending all behaviors or all habits. And then so I can come together with Virgo, so I can match with Virgo. But right now, I'm still thinking, I'm still strategizing. I still am not 100% confident yet, but I'm, but I'm willing. That's what I'm seeing here. Okay, Virgo, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. <clears throat> Excuse me if you did. Please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to all of my other channels. All the links are in the description box below. I just posted my new vlog, latest vlog um, on my travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. I was featuring my last two days in Da Nang, Vietnam, what I did there. But yeah, check it out if you want to. And Virgo, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button so you'll be notified every time when I post your videos. And yeah, that's it. Take care, Virgo. Hope to see you back here again soon. I love you. Bye.